All right, let's talk about editors. In order to actually write some HTML and CSS, uh, if you've written any HTML, you know that you need a, basically a text editing program. And so as developers, we call these editors. Now, my preferred editor of choice is Sublime, and that's because it's incredibly fast. It's incredibly flexible. Uh, you sort of get the best of all worlds. Um, there's plugins for literally everything. Um, so if you need like certain syntax highlighting, guess what? There's a plugin for that. Um, so I love Sublime. And that's going to be my first option is Sublime. Now, you don't have to stick with Sublime. There are other options available for you. For example, you can also use uh, VS Code. You can use Atom. You can use Brackets. You can use... Oh, what other ones? Uh, Komodo, Notepad, Notepad++. Actually, I'll write that one down. Notepad++. And so you have all these different options in here. So which one do you choose? Well, it really depends on you. Uh, VS Code is super popular. It's 2017. Uh, 2018 VS Code is going to be super popular. People love Atom, but it takes a little bit of time to load up. People don't really like that. Um, Mac users tend to love brackets because you also get a little preview. What I'm doing here is I've got uh, my editor, Sublime, open on the left. And on the right, I have Chrome open to basically preview all my changes, whereas brackets sort of has that built in. And then there's Notepad++, which is super popular, but super basic. I mean, if you need to edit like a seven megabyte file, Sublime or Notepad are probably your best options, but chances are you'll never need to do that. So uh, your task for this is to go and download an editor. If you don't have an editor, you need one. So uh, go with Sublime, VS Code, Atom, or Brackets. Uh, typically sticking with one of these four is a good idea because there's a lot of support out there. Um, a lot of people are using these already. So if you have questions, you can just Google it and you'll find an answer almost instantly. So your task is to go and get an editor.